No, it ain't. No, it ain't. But you gotta know the territory. <laughs> Made the people wanna get, wanna get, wanna get up and go. Seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, twenty.
run out of town on a rail. Because in order to sell bandage ribbons and instruction books and uniforms, he has to guarantee to keep them kids out of play. Well, and to form them kids into a band to sell as a leader. What's our about that? He doesn't know one note from another. That's what's wrong with that. He doesn't know a piccolo from a high board. So I'm going to catch up to the swindling few bits and them over here. And when I do, I'll squeal on him so loud! I'd like to be there when you catch up to this fellow. Not on this trip. Not on Iowa. Even the great Professor Harold Hill wouldn't try to sell the beast in those little hot guys. Gentlemen, you intrigue me. I think I'll have to give Iowa a try. I don't believe I got your name. Before you get your grip on that. Male or female? 
music teacher? She's a librarian. Female. Oh, perfect. That's what I wanted to hear. If she passes by here, point her out to me. I will. So how are you going to find the picture? Well, same old way. I'll keep that music teacher off balance. Then my next step will be to get your town out of this serious trouble it's in. Where does any internet get in trouble? Well, well, then I'll have to create some. I'll have to create a desperate need for a boys' band. You remember. Yeah. Now it's new around here. What can I use? Mm, not too much. Except uh, the billiard parlor just got a new pool table. They never had a pool table here before? No. Nah. Only billiards. That'll do. See you later, Mars. Oh, don't forget, music teacher. Music teacher. Got it. Are you Mr. Dunlop? Yep. Well, either you are closing your eyes to a situation you do not wish to acknowledge, or you are not aware of the caliber of disaster indicated by the presence of a pool table in your community. Well, you got trouble, my friend. Right here I say trouble right here in the River City. Why, sure, I'm a video player, so be mighty proud to say I'm always mighty proud to say it. I consider that the hours I spend with a cue in my hand are golden. Help you cultivate horse sense and a cool head and a keen eye. Did you ever take a try to give an ironclad seat to yourself from a three rail billiard shot? Well, just as I say, it takes judgment, brains, and maturity to score in a ball flying game. I say that any boob can take and shove a ball in a pocket. And I call that slop the first big step on the road to the depths of day for day. I say first, medicinal wine from a teaspoon, then beer from a bottle. And the next thing you know, your son is playing for money in a pinchback suit. And listening to some big out-of-town jester hearing him tell about horse race gambling. Not a wholesome trot race, no, but a race where they set down right on the horse. Like to see some stuck-up jockey boy sitting on Dan Patch. Make your blood boil, well, I should say. Now, friends, let me tell you what I mean. You got one, two, three, four, five, six pockets on the table. Pockets that mark the difference between a gentleman and a bum. With a capital B in that rhymes with P, and that stands for pool. And all week long, your River City youth will be frittering away. I said, your young men will be frittering. Frittering away their noontime, supper time, chore time, too. Get the ball in the pocket, never mind getting dandelions, bowl to the screen door, pets to the beast take. Never mind pumping any water to your parents or pot for the sister and empty on Saturday night, and that's in trouble. Yes, you got lots and lots of trouble. I'm thinking of the kids in the knickerbocker. Shook tells me what's peeking in the pool all wonder about the school, you got trouble. Folks, right here in River City. Trouble with the capital T and that rhymes with P and that stands for pool. Now I know all you folks are the right kind of parents. I'm gonna be perfectly frank. Would you like to know what kind of conversation goes on while they're loafing around that hall? They've been trying out the people, trying out the two trying out tailor maids like cigarette beans, and bragging all about how they're gonna cover up the telltale breath with sunset. One fine night, they leave the pool hall, heading for the dance at the army, libertine men and scarlet women, and ragtime! Shame this music that'll drag your son, your daughter, with the arms of a jungle, animal instinct, mass stereo! Friends, the idol brain is the devil's playground. Trouble, right here in River City. With a capital T and that rhymes with P and that stands for fool. We surely got trouble, right here in River City. You gotta figure out a way to keep the young ones bored after school. My children, children gonna have trouble. The mothers of River City, heed that warning before it's too late. Watch for the telltale signs of corruption. The manager son leave the house. Does he rebuckle his knickerbockers below the knee? Is there a nicotine stain on his index finger? A dime novel hidden in the corn bin? Is he starting to memorize jokes out of Captain Billy's whiz bang? Are certain words creeping into his conversation? Words like, like swell, aha, and so is your old man. Well, so, my friends, you got trouble. Right here in River City. With a capital T and that rhymes with P and that stands for pool. We've surely got trouble. Right here in River City. Remember the main Plymouth Rock and the Golden Rule. Oh, we got trouble. We're in terrible, terrible trouble. That game with the 15 numbered balls is the devil's tool. Oh, yes, we got trouble, trouble, trouble.
Well, didn't I meet you in Chicago? No. Well, I'll only be in town for a short while. Good. 